Welcome back to Runex. I completely forgot about something. We have boss kill count achievements we still need to get, and a lot of them. Um, I did a Kraken task, which got me, you know, closer towards that one. Ooh, someone got a Smoldering Stone at 4 kill. <laughs> I completed Cold-Blooded Killer 2, which gets me a Crystal Key and 500k, and... 5,000 runex points. I would think that... Well, okay. Lizardmen Shaman are really easy. God, I... I can't wait until I liquidate my skilling supplies and just my bank is so much cleaner. But, um... Yeah, that's a fair reward for that, honestly. Uh... Out of curiosity, is it time to open some, uh... You know, some... Crystal keys, Santa? Yeah. I still don't feel like I have good enough gear to bother with Narda. But, uh, yeah, I'm getting... Let me get my task first. Ooh, Kraken. But uh, I'm getting 24 plus 17, so that's like... I'm getting 41 points per boss task. So... <laughs> yeah. It's pretty amazing. Ugh. Uh, actually, I'm gonna go ahead and... Can I extend the task? Or is that automatically done because it's... Oh, yeah, there we go. That's the good stuff. <laughs> uh, yeah. Because I figure I'll extend the tasks for things that I still need drops from. Because, obviously, from the Kraken, I want a trident of the seas and i want how many kraken tentacles do i need overall assuming a success on the first try for the infernal let's see oh it's just the regular whips and one tentacle okay huh i would have expected it to be like you have to have the abyssal tentacle the lava tentacle and the frozen tentacle Huh. All right then. Like that's still a way, a ways off, but I mean, it pays to get as much as I can out of the way early. Uh, for this one, I just want even more prayer potions. And of course, you know, the pet would be cool, but uh, the pets aren't that on this game because you can get dupes. Wait, what? When did I... What? <laughs> I didn't even notice for quite a bit that I got a Kraken pet. What? 170 KC. Oh, I see. It's a pet kraken. Alright. Boss pets are... Uh, just pets in general on this server, are, in my opinion, lose their value by not being unique. But, hey. That's... Huh. Like, I was, I noticed after I was getting on Oshlog for getting a Smoldering Stone at one Cerberus KC. I'm like, wait, wait, what, what's that in my inventory? Oh. Like, I completely missed that, like, three kills ago. Huh. One in 1,000 drop, although I do have the Slayer Emblems, Roe. Iron Man bonus. But, like, still, that's 
kind of cool. All right, so I finished a giant mole task as well as that kraken task, and I, let's have some fun. Let's go ahead and turn in the mole parts. I also have an achievement to claim, but... Let's see, exchange the mole skins. Yeah, Marantils, Torstals, uh, Glum Seeds. Yikes. There's some Skiller tokens. Um, I think I got like two or three tooth halves of keys, like from the drop table, not. Oh, you killed that thing. Yeah, I've got two of those. Just gearing up for the next crystal key event, I guess. Don't even remember. Oh, those were from Kraken. Uh, let's see. Where is my other parts? I want to turn in the claws next. And then click the achievement. Oops. Wow. Okay, the claws are the good ones. Don't need the Terramin seeds, but two lamps, that's ten rune coins? Or, yeah, that's 10.6. Get some nice skilling supplies there. And then an over in. Mall is medium, right? Yeah. Oh, a, a prize box. Oh, 50 blue charms is actually pretty good. In all fairness. Um, what is the highest blue charm thing I can do right now? I might just pop a uh, XP scroll and... Let's see here. Crimson... You know what? Let's go ahead and see if I can't just hammer through. No, I don't have the. I definitely do not have the charms for 99 summoning, unfortunately. Where am I on charms, though? Ah! Uh, actually, not doing terrible. Especially with the charming imp. But, uh, yeah. Let's see, what else we got? Kraken. Do I have the blood of runes to go back to Kraken? I'm not gonna extend. Extending was a fool's errand. Ooh. I am hurting for blood runes. I was kind of flexing on someone who was like, oh, I want the mole pet. Uh, well, let's give it a shot anyway, I guess. No point not doing that. So I just want to point out that I'm pretty sure bags of riches are rigged to go to people with less than 50 kill count on wilderness creatures, because there are constantly like 2 kill count, 1 kill count, 12 kill count bags from green dragons and Anku in the wilderness. At first I didn't buy into this conspiracy. But as it happens more and more, and I still have not seen a triple-digit kill count bag of riches, uh, there's no other explanation. It is rigged to keep people in the wilderness because it's like, oh man, I I get I I keep getting these bags of riches. These are awesome items. 
I, I buy into it now. Also, I've turned up my mic this video um, at the request of several people, including Sai there. Um, Shoutouts. Also, this is unrelated to Runex, but this clip is being recorded the same night as the Game Awards, and... So, I just want to say... I had the best timing to find out about the first DLC fighter. Some people are legitimately avoiding spoilers until they can play the game, so I don't want to talk about it, but I was watching The Office with my dad. I come back, I unpause Lobos Jr.'s restream of it because he's who I was watching it through, and then the announcement starts, and I was very confused and then shocked it was kind of amazing also shout outs to the task streak system because i get like 50 points per freaking uh boss task oh i actually completed the third uh kraken achievement i didn't think i'd do that so quickly but uh there we go. Tentacle Severance 3 completed. That's three more Crystal Keys and 50 Dragon Stones? That's, um... That's an interesting choice of reward. I mean, I guess it does drop Dragon Stone Rings? <laughs> but, uh... Yeah, uh, up to 86 Dagonoth kills, 34 Mole kills, 99 Cerberus kill. Wow, next Cerberus task, I'm gonna actually finish the third achievement. They need to rebalance some of these achievement rewards, I feel, because Cerberus is a much more active, I guess, boss than Kraken. Like, I... I don't even need food. I am literally just protecting from magic in infinity robes. Casting Ivan's Blast. And I'm good. Um, but it gives more crystal keys than Cerberus's achievement. Though to be fair, I guess I am killing more. Yeah, that's going to take a lot of Lizardman Shaman tasks. Uh, Thermonuclear Smoke Devil. I haven't gotten any tasks for him yet, surprisingly. I'd like to for the ring, but... Huh. I really hope you can't get assigned Wilderness Bosses, because that would be pretty terrible. Especially because I don't have a Varax set. Because, like, that and Guthan, or Guthan or like the two sets that are helpful because Varax is good for actually doing uh, Calphite Queen as well. But, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. I don't know what else to say at this point. I'll see you on the next drop that makes me laugh. Or when there's a freaking Crystal Key event, finally. The crap? Uh, this is gonna be hard to commentate over while also... Um, trying to survive here, but... Um, <laughs> second kill at General Gerardor. Um, using the probably outdated uh, Sergeant Kush method of freezing and running, and then using Blood Barrage to heal. Why are, I don't know why my mouse movement is so bad right now, but um, I got a Grand Crest piece one. Um, Grand Crest is like end game crystal key basically that's the way i think of it anyway 
Okay, I need to raise this fool. Okay. Tick eat. Tick eat. Wow, this is sketchy. It would be cool if there were like uh, a blessing that. Ah! I clicked off the window. God. I am bad at recording active boss fights. But, um. It would be cool if there was like a blessing that made. Um. Ceratomen brews not lower th stats, or at least not lower them as much. But uh, yeah, I have a 20 GWD bosses task, so I figured, eh, what better time to try and get into GWD, you know? Oh god, I hate how far he can hit melee. I am not... Uh, I feel like there's probably an easier boss, but uh, hey, I got the freaking Grand Crest piece. That is a little ridiculous. I'm about halfway through, but uh, well, first of all, three RM's items in like as many Barrow's tasks, that's interesting. But for no particular reason, I kind of want to just clean out my Rune Coin tab. So let's turn off placeholders while I pull this stuff out. Uh, do I have no weapon poisons? Okay. Turn those back on, get my Ring of Greed out. Don't want to forget to wear that. Um, Rowi is out of... It's not at risk. Uh, no. Oh, there we go. And I get a, wow, nearly a thousand. Uh, actually that gives me about 1k, yeah, 1k rune coins. Um, how many do I need for some of the gambles? I know I'm going for the permanent stuff first, I'm just kind of curious, like, so the torso requires 750. Yikes, that is expensive for like one strength and six accuracies. Uh, I already have that. Evoid is 5k per attempt. I don't understand why the scaling backpack. Well, I guess it does include the Ring of Wealth effect, but, like, who who uses this? Like, its defenses are not... Like, it's marginally a better cape than a basic skill cape. It's a Ring of Wealth skill cape is what it is. Other than that, I don't really need the, uh... Rune coins for gambles, I guess. Do I? I guess I do need it for the corrupted brace. But that's. <laughs> that's, um. <laughs> Holy crap, that is. The corrupted bracelet is awesome. How do I get that? Is it a drop? It's not. Does the Wilde Trader sell that? Why 
it's cracked. No, no, no. But the cursed gloves are awesome. So that's a thing. Huh. I think that's what I'm going to spend future blood money on. Because those are sweet. Alright. Back to Slayer. I think, uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and, after this task, take a break from doing bosses. Um, because while it's cool, it's... I don't know. Not getting any drops? Well, I can't say I'm not getting any drops, because I am getting Barrow's items. I am getting, you know, a warrior's ring, whatever. Um, I did get the Kraken pet, but... Yeah, I think I'm gonna go back to doing medium tasks, because I feel like they were going way faster. Um, I'm now using Fire Surge. <laughs> with the smoke battle staff because this is doing wonders like hitting 50s at barrows 15 crystal keys and no uh sign of a crystal key opening event by the way felt inspired to finally finish the um oh master blood orb can I sell that back for blood money? I'm actually not sure. Um, to go and finally finish my Money Monsoon 2 achievement. Um, because remember, my current goal, along with the View Air Helm, is to get um, 150 achievements. Because I have to see what the freaking perk of the achievement cape is. Plus, this gets me another Chaotic, which gives me a shot at the Rapier. Nice! Wow, I... Huh. So, the Rapier is really my Slayer weapon. Uh, the CLS is good. It's great, even. But it... Um... Increase blood running by 100% while in a backpack. Or still on a stack. Or it's lost on death. Can I... Like, turn this back into blood money, though. Blood orb exchange. No, I can't. Oh, this is like the... One, two, three, four... Yeah, this is just the five mil one. This isn't the 15 mil. Oh, it is actually the 15 mil. Huh. In any case, now that that's done, um, I just kind of felt like, you know what, I, I want to go through dailies because I wanted, you know, crystal keys from the voting and experiment daily. Um, but uh, at this point, I need to find, I guess really what I need to find out is if there's a perk on the diary cape. I guess the, the Donator Mystery Box can be super good. Like, we could get, like, a Shaman Ring or a Thermo Ring or something. That would be kind of cool, at least. But, uh... Alright, I will see you in the next clip. I really have no idea what... The clip's gonna be because I never really do. No bag of riches? No. No. I've been not really participating in the event a lot, still just waiting for the freaking crystal key event to occur while I'm online. But I do have a thousand shards. Um, I just don't want this to take up the whole video like the Halloween event kept doing. <coughs> Um, I just did a Frost Jad run, so I figured, eh, might as well. Oh! 
that's actually a nice surprise. Less of a nice surprise, but hey, that points towards my cannon. Alright, I'm like eight normal tasks away from my, uh, you know, let's go for another boss. Easy money. Just a small hint for players of the server who are, you know, newer. Uh, the rapier, as you'd expect, <clears throat> is primarily a stab weapon. You need to use the controlled attack option to actually stab, though. The other options are slash for some reason. I don't know if that's a holdover from pre-EOC or just an oversight, maybe, on the developer's part. But, uh, yeah, you gotta use that if you want your max accuracy, which is actually significantly better at the mole, I'm finding, because that is a, what, 16 accuracy difference? Um, I'm just soul-splitting with my tanky gear, and it's actually going super well. Uh... No, I don't think the mole drops anything unique. It's mostly just to get you herbs and seeds, um, and very rarely Grand Crest pieces. But Grand Crest stuff is for like end game, like true end game, like getting our like Waria. Um, hang on, it's in the I don't know, like getting the grand stuff. Well, that's from the, yeah, Arcane Archon Warrior stuff is from the Grand Crests. So, like, it's nice to get a crest right now, but uh, it's not something that I'm actively going to farm, you know. Finished a mole task, and I always like recording obtaining the loot from these tasks. I, I don't know why, it's just... I enjoy... it. Ooh! A full crystal key from the skins. Real good seeds, too. God. So, if I haven't made it clear, um, after I get my Fused Slayer Helm, I'm gonna go ahead and buy the other $5 bond, so I have Donator, uh, so that I have access to the um, premium bankers. I don't even really care much about the donator zone. Um, I'm mostly going to be using home anyway, just because uh, Edgeville is iconic. Uh, wow. Jeez, I am getting some... Don't you dare, you giant adorable loot pinata. Uh, I don't really like using donor zones and the, the using donor zones that much, which is probably really weird. Um, it's just home areas are usually the iconic area for a server, and we are up to 19 crystal keys. Still no event. Uh, but, uh, yeah. Gonna continue with the uh, old boss tasks. Got some Barrows Brothers right now. I love surging, it is so good. All right, see you guys if I get, I don't even, it's not even worth recording Barrow's drops, honestly. It's really, um, th there's no Barrow's item I want except Varax. Do I have any Varax? I think I liquidated some of it. I have the flail. I do have the flail. Um, and Varax is real good for the wilderness bosses when I eventually want to get the wards. And.
and for Calphite Queen. Exciting stuff. Alright, I'll see you if I get a cool task or when I get the help. Yo, I happened to get to the computer. I was up doing something. I There's a Crystal Key event going on. Heck yeah. Let's see. Let's do five at a time, because you get like three items. Let's see. Do, do, do. Um, game? Uh, I'm having that one bug where shift click clicks through the. A ring of wealth? Really? Okay. Just gonna dump things in there. I'll go for 10. Ah, oh, you can't hold one. Ooh, D chain. Drop some of the crap. Dragon plate legs. I mostly keep those because they're semi valuable. Oh, I finally got some friggin' blood runes in a crystal chest. That's rare for me, anyway. Uh, not sure why I'd need more penance gloves, but I do have more attempts at them. Friggin' shift click bug. I think it's related to just having the client open too long or something. Wow, just the crystal keys I've banked have practically gotten me another roll. That is pretty amazing. Don't care about combination runes. Yeah, that is... <laughs> that is an obscene amount of shards from just opening crystal keys. And the D chains are, again, fighter torso E attempts. So, how many do I have once I finally decide to grind that out? I have six. Holy crap. Alright then. No broadcasts, but, you know. Nerf and all. But, uh, yeah, that was fun. I like opening a bunch of crystal keys and stuff. Uh, I'll see you for the Slayer Helm, I guess. I just wanted to show that I have gone ahead and purchased myself a, bond, a $5 bond on my uh, Sponsor from Scratch account by drop trading the money, which is legal. I've checked this several times. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I am now a regular donor. This really means... All it really means is I can use, for the series I mean, I can use uh, premium bankers. And these are at like the farming spots, in the abyss, in other convenient places. Um, I didn't know that you also get a re regular donator pack. It contains skilling supplies and a mystery box item. Okay, so it gave me skilling supplies and the dragon bones, I guess. All right, um, but yeah, uh, just wanted to do that real fast so that um, my skilling grind goes by much more quickly. I am. <laughs> I I just need to do one boss task and then rush an easy task i think no 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 no. i can just finish this cerberus task and get my next slayer helm all right so this is going to be the last clip of the video because i'm going to record the last kill but i'm starting here because doo -doo -doo, we have completed dog whisperer 2 and gotten three bonus mystery boxes it'd be funny if i got the slayer points i needed but uh, 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 there's no 
it right now. It would be a waste of the crystal key. Um, between every uh, Cerberus kill, I've been just um, not banking, but coming to home to uh, use the nurse for a quick heal and prayer renewal. But I just like recording the last kill or last couple of kills if it's a normal task of a task before a helmet. It just feels rewarding. So yeah, this is a pretty typical kill for me. The only real difference between now and before, because this I use the longsword because it's better for bosses, because it hits harder instead of faster. Or more accurately instead of faster, really. But um the only real difference is I am using the Slayer Cape and the Melee Helm, so I have like I think it's five percent more damage than the regular helm provides. It's still a pretty basic boss. I'm probably going to complete this boss before I get a Spectral Spirit Shield, which is apparently how you're able to stop the prayer drain, but... Well, I don't know. I'm... I'd hopefully have Primordials before going to Serb, or to Corp, because I it, it's melee boots, and you use melee at Corp, you just do, you use a spear, uh, the Karatsi spear with the Karamja gloves, or the Zamorak Costa, but uh, either way, that's a Slayer task completed, I guess Slayer tasks are the current event, that's over a thousand Slayer points again. Uh, this time I am getting the Mage Helm just because I find myself using Mage way more often than I use, um, range. Boom. So all I need is the ranged and the fused. Um, I'm gonna end the video here, and next time I am going to be getting the fused helm because it's going to be even faster to get. What what can I say? How much does that? Is that that's only five? Huh. Okay. So before I was thinking like, man, there's like nothing to spend Slayer points on past uh, the helm. You get like no reason except the damage bonus to do tasks, but. Chaotics are 150 rune coins each. That is actually not a terrible way to farm rune coins. Huh. In any case, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, next one is probably going to start with another Slayer Helm, unless I get a ridiculous drop. Um, during Slayer point events, I am, of course, going to just spam easies. But, uh... How long is this one going on anyway? Oh, pfft. well, let's see how many I can knock out. Uh, you know what? No. Wow. <laughs> Jeez, the rock slug room. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god, all the items on the ground. <laughs> oh, oh my god, all the dragon darts. <laughs> I just was not expecting that. Uh, I'll see you next time with the Range Slayer Elf.